in the north of the Syrian capital, the Harasta suburb, or what is locally known as Al-Assad suburb, has recently become one of the front lines around Damascus. The area is witnessing heavy clashes between army forces and militants. Still, civilians seem to continue with their normal life, despite terrorists' attempt to take control over the district. Life here is almost normal. We are steadfast here. We are not leaving our homes. We will stay here, owing to our sons who are defending us. Here where I'm standing on Damascus Homs International Highway, militants are only less than one kilometer away from here on my left, while civilian areas are located on my right. The Damascus Homs International Highway, which was the main route for passengers heading to the Syrian capital, has now become a dead end. After militants' attack last month, the highway is now like a separation line between Syrian army-controlled areas and the militants' strongholds in eastern Ghouta, Douma, and areas like Harista that is witnessing heavy clashes. Harasta suburb's importance is that it is the northern gateway to Damascus, but militants won't take it because our soldiers are protecting it. The Syrian has been battling foreign-backed militants in the country since 2011. The violence has so far left more than 250,000 people dead and millions displaced. Syrian army has recently made major gains against terrorists. Many Syrians hope that Syrian army can secure more areas so that they can return to their homes. From one of Damascus demarcation lines, Zahra Ad-Darzi, Press TV, Harasta suburb.